Hello everybody, Jet here, and welcome back to our Cracker Drag playthrough as the Norse Dwarves, where we've been expanding nicely, though we are about to potentially have something pop up here, which we are moving lots of armies into place to try and um, deal with, hopefully, maybe, we'll see what happens um, when it happens, but uh, yeah, it's going to be interesting, basically we're about to have the end times and it is the Skaven, so yeah. Uh, we've been pushing the orcs out of Kislev, but Kislev has other chaos problems and um, itself problems. And the Tsarina, the Tsarina betrayed me. The frozen kingdom welcomes Traitor. all. Its Traitor. Um, yeah, for some reason she's hating me uh, on me at the moment. So we'll, we'll we'll see how that goes though as time goes on. Yeah, and that's kind of where we are. If you don't remember from last time. Oh yeah, and we had a horrible incursion in the north, and we've been battered a bit up here, which is really annoying. Um, because a lot of my build up here has been dealt with and we've got all multiple chaos forces attacking us here. Though we are going to jump over here at some point and hit them as well. But we probably need to deal with the Skaven first, because, because Skaven. Uh, going to put them in different places each. Uh, you're going to jump over as well. There we go. It's gonna be fun. Not. Why? Why did it have to be Skaven? There we go. So obviously we're not a war. Oh, and hold fast is going to go down and explore the eight peaks. But yeah, well, we are. Not at war with the uh, war host of the apocalypse yet. It is very much a case of yet. Um, we're also going to piss off the rest of the dwarves soon because I'm going to declare myself the king in the north. The high king of the dwarves in the north. The true leader of dwarfdom. And I say that might actually be problematic. The other, while they're not close enough to do much to me, they are actually, some of them have quite big territories, so, you know. Gromy does look to be coming for my southern empire as well, my southern kingdom. It's more of a little kingdom, duchy. You know. Um. <clears throat> but I'm, I'm not that worried. We will fend him off easily. And as I said, soon we're going to be at the position where we are going to be able to start pushing into Norska proper as well. Uh, yeah, go on. I will take that with some pointy ears. I know they're pointy ears, but they're trade up. They're, 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 they're friendly, tradey pointy ears rather than the normal evil ones. Runecraft. To war. Moving. What? You insult me. Onward. Rune Lord. Lord of Clan Mordor. Okay. Yes. I'm not going to swap them there, but actually he's going to go into the center because he's probably the best equipped to defend against it. Um. Hmm. My anger burns bright. Straight back into this settlement. You can start leveling up. I want to get the walls out here faster this time. That was my problem. Last time. You know what? No, I'm not building that there. Let's uh, actually go and move. Hold fast myself. Pointy ears. And Dowie's are. But we are making a pilgrimage in, into to the Eight Peaks here. To uh, see the glory of what once was down there. Nah. Nah. 
No, and once once we've got dealt with the Skaven incursion, I'm probably going to mass my forces and launch a big invasion into Norska, guys, because it's just that the Chaos forces are just being in a constant annoyance, and we will, you know, we're at the point now where we can probably start rolling over it. So, yeah, I will take that defensive alliance. Yeah, we can probably start rolling through Norska uh, quite nicely. The Empire is surprisingly large. I mean, we're not small, but the Empire is huge. I suspect the Empire is probably the most powerful faction. We'll have to have a look, actually. He is definitely coming for me, isn't he? If I, if I almost managed to get a full... A full... Oh, no, I'm not, not fighting any Nurgle or Corniger boys, but I've got... I've got Siege and Slanesh working together against me? That feels wrong. Oh, that's just what hunt. I was like, is that another endgame crisis? I'm sure I only put one on. Yeah, Reichland Grimgore? Which is surprising, because he's only over there. I'm free. Now. Yes. Do I? Do I go now? Yes. Yes, I do. Aye. Will be it's time. I may have to turn around, but Weld. yes. I'll cast the runes. I do. Suppose so. Let's can chill here while we start rebuilding. Lord of Clan Morgrim. Yes. Let's rip all of these out then. So we can get more economy. The wise one. There we go. The glory of the eight peaks once more. Oh, it does look like they mostly hold it. And yeah, and we're just going to keep going south now because there's some really cool things down here as well, I can see now. And I can use even use some seaways, but I want to see the mountains down here. And down here. Come at me. Come on. You big... Uh, don't want to say the F word in... The F-A-T word in case YouTube doesn't like it. <laughs> you big rotund goblin. Come at me. Come on. Come at me. Come on, ho oh, ho ho He didn't quite manage to get to me. Because <clears throat> he's big and rotund. Do you think they might be trying to ambush me, guys? Do you think I'm going to fall for it? I think when you're in ambush stance, they shouldn't see your army moving. Talk at me in your crude lung. You get... I mean, you, you literally wiped yourselves out. If they'd managed to take it, it would have been quite a coup for them, but it was never going to happen. Summon me if you dare. There we go. And that was their capital. Right, why am I not already building another army? I am a fool. Ooh, I like that. What? Setting off. The 
This is going to be one. Diplomatic relations with dwarves. Minus 150. <laughs> but it also means I can take that. Because I'm putting myself in a very interesting position. <laughs> I? Tomorrow. Open. One rug. Our king of Kum. Fetch the... All right. Oath bound. Because obviously all the other dwarves are going to hate me after I I I show our that we are the true dwarves. Onwards. I mean they've done well. They've got most of it, but the Dabbies are are still are, are still uh, fallen. I mean, it's not even a proper settlement, guys. You can deal with that. Ready. Thirsts for war. Vengeful rune lord. Goodbye, Mr. Large Goblin. Time for a reckoning, boys. I still won't quite peace. I'm a bit surprised. This army needs to double time this way because I suspect I'm going to get a scaven incursion down here somewhere as well, but I'm not entirely sure. The axe thirsts for war. You know what? Let's grab that. I should have probably fought the battle against Grommy, but this way I'm guaranteed, I'm guaranteed to wipe him out. So, ooh, ooh, I see they've got another force, and they are pushing quite hard against me. So, yeah, I'm not upset about that. It's maybe I should have been ready to pull back against the Skaven. Ooh. Oh no, that's just normal Skaven. That's not Skaven appearing again. That isn't the beginning of the end. I mean, the Empire is potentially going to have its heart ripped out when this happens. Yeah, the only thing is I might want to leave the, ki the King in Menor for a while because I might want to be ready to try and grab... Oh, they're trying to sneak past me. Ugh. That could be problematic. I may have to go trigger that ambush, which I don't want to do. Oh, they still have a force. Yeah. It begins. Oh, God. Oh, interesting. Rune Ricky. Getting out of what? here. Can I help you? Most master what? of masters. Master of runecraft. Hot leaving. There we go. Forward. I was expecting them to have Forward. appeared here and there to be more they get multiple waves, I think. They're not even technically at war with me yet. Yet being the operative word. Armed and ready. It is time. I do not think so. Time for a reckoning. Bring them. Hit them. Oh, you kids. Ooh. 
I'm I'm sorry guys, I, I just love fighting the these guys. The I should have let them come at me to be fair. My axe thirsts for war. Oh, if only I could get some bears. I guess we're chilling for a bit, so let's start some recruitment. What do you want? Yes. As good as done. Lord. Try and sneak past me. Vengeful rule, Lord. I hope the work must begin. Okay, I think we're okay. I think we're okay uh, down here. For now. My anger burns bright. Okay. I love when we get to this point of the campaign where it's just so much admin. <laughs> I'm a bit surprised I lost so much there. Again, I'm not. I, I, I could have fought it, but at this point, it, it, we've got other things to worry about. Nope. <clears throat> I have a peace treaty with them for the moment because it just means I can ignore them for a while, basically. Yeah, the Empire. I, I, I might have to worry about the Empire starting to take um, Norska soon. Because Franz is on a warpath. Get me honest, Franz may just dominate the world and bring peace at this rate. No, sorry guys, the factions I really hate fighting against are um, Siege and Skaven. So, um, especially as dwarves, because, yeah. To war. Rune Lord. Rune Lord. I am armed and ready. Do I actually want to start a fight with them? Master of Runecraft. Can I help you? What? I'm leaving. What? On my way. Time for a reckoning. Possibly, but I want to make sure I'm completely positioned before I do anything. No for you. Summon me if you dare. Wait, why are we taking attrition? Iron willed. Ice. I may actually oh, have to fall back. God damn it. Summon me if you dare. For the wisdom. That guy's literally just to provide a little extra sort of support. Hmm. I think I overegged it a bit with uh, some of my my pushing, and I was expect. I I think we are gonna get more Skaven soon. I think this is the initial incursion, which kind of distracts you. I thought I had a non-aggression pact with her. <clears throat> Kislev is worrying me at the moment with their. They're changing odd things with me without me realizing. Reichland is just terrifying, and if they decide they don't like me, I could be in trouble. Oh, this is where this is where playing as somebody like um, 
um, sneaky guy, the changeling, would be brilliant because you could just sit there and go, I think I I I just want to make the Golden Order and uh, Reichland fight. I mean, it would potentially make them more want right, one of them more powerful, but it would be a fantastic war to watch. They may actually get some territory there from look out because that and that territory's not built up. Right, it's time. One rug. Aye, grudges will be settled. Let us begin. And now. I'm too smart, clever for them. Wipe them out. Yes. It's as good as done. But you see, I'm not sure they're actually destroyed. I think it's a distraction. I think it's a, oh, it's already done. I'm fine moment, if you see what I mean. Lord of Clan Borgrim. I need support. Rune Ricky. This army's gonna start moving next turn. I may have to pull back. Cancel yes. building and pull back. <laughs> Summon me if you dare. Tell you what, guys, I am stopping here because I need to have a think about what I want to do next. Uh, sorry, it's a short one, but I'm I'm really umming and ahhing, basically. Um, yeah, I'm really umming and ahhing about whether or not I should fall back there or not. Uh, please do like and subscribe if you are enjoying this, guys. Um, as always, sorry it's a bit of a shorter episode. Um, yeah, and comments down below. Let me you know, let me know what you think I should do, because this will be my last one this week, since I might not have recorded any more. And other than that, as always, an extra special thank you to our channel members and patrons. That's Monster the Band, Nose Nose, Andrew T, Pritaru, Coding Monster, Jason Air, Egg, Scrin, Newbie One Kenobi, Jared Horn, Good Sir Twisted, and Space Ace 475. And thank you, everyone, for watching. Cheers. Up.